January 16. National Nothing Day. Ever been caught doing nothing and shamed into feeling lazier than the average person? Rest assured, that might not happen today, January 16, National Nothing Day. National Nothing Day has been celebrated since 1973. A mind teaser does occur to us, though if you're doing nothing, aren't you doing something, with nothing as the thing you're doing. In 1972, journalist Harold Pullman Coffin proposed National Nothing Day as a non-event by doing nothing every January 16. The next year, National Nothing Day made Chase's calendar of events, which marks annual occasions in print since the 1950s. National Nothing Day is sponsored by Coffin's own National Nothing Foundation. Unsurprisingly, there is nothing to be found about that organization. True to its title, it doesn't even have a website. Not only this, there are other days celebrated in contrast to this idea of nothingness. In opposition to National Nothing Day, the Realist Society of Canada, RSC, has a religious holiday called There's Always Been Something Day, pronounced THAPS, which is dedicated on July 8 to the celebration of the Realizoran, that if there was ever nothing, there would be nothing now. History is full of debates between philosophers and writers on studying nothing. Because the question is, what is nothing? To answer the question of nothing, one must find the meaning of nothing. Even the true nature of nothingness in outer space causes disagreements between experts, because many claim even a true space devoid of anything is nothing. After all, in space, quantum particles exist even without gravity. On National Nothing Day, the day's promotion is contradictory, because the day is meant as an unevent, which means it should not be seen as an event, and refers to a thing of no importance, consequence, or interest. Thank you for watching the video. Do like and subscribe for daily updates.